Oops, my name is Travis's one and welcome back to Super Mario Maker 2. Uh, so I had a little bit of a flub happen. I was going to show you the Swamp Romp by Paco. I'm still going to. As you can see, I have cleared this level. Look at that. I've got a clear and I've got a heart. But you see, the problem's pretty simple. My recorder stopped recording on me in the middle of it, and it made me pretty agitated. Actually, very agitated. So, guess who's going to be showing off this? Who's, guess who's going to be completing this level twice? Anyway, let's go ahead and play. I, I'm hoping it'll be faster the second time. But I got pretty consistent at this. There's a little bit of... I don't know if it's technically cheese or not, but we'll talk about that in a little bit. The big point of discussion that I want to bring today is the new level list. And what I mean by level list is... Hold on. Can we get this first try? Of course not. Um... In the description below, there will be a list for the levels I will be completing in order. They they range from puzzle levels to speed runs to auto scrolls like this one to just basic platformers, etc. And they're all extremely difficult levels. Come on, first try. Dang it! That's a spring drop right there. It's pretty hard. Um, but yeah, they range from all sorts of things. This took me an hour and a half to beat this, and this was the next one. It's technically Hot Sponge was the first one. But this is like a whole series and whatnot. And that's the overall plan. Or plan of action. Anyway, a little bit about this level. I'll, I'll talk more about that after I complete this. Again. Um, <laughs> a little bit about this level. This is a pretty fun level. It's very challenging. It's very difficult. Obviously, it's a step up from Hot Sponge, in my opinion. Just It's only, like, 0.06% like harder. But, like, in this game, that's really... That's a lot more than what you think. Like, it, if people are from the GD community, that's pretty much the difference between, that can be the difference between an insane and extreme demon. It's pretty, it's pretty nuts. Um, and just to kind of put this into perspective, this level is pretty hard. Um, there's levels that are obviously harder than this, but... So we're coming up to a part that I have to do a little differently because I find it quite inconsistent. So you're technically supposed to hit that Goomba, and you're technically supposed to hit that Goomba too. But the problem is, is I find that part to be super inconsistent, and not the way that it, in that the way that it works, <laughs> is really inaccurate for me. So I've found that it is easier just to avoid the entire problem and do it the way I do. So you just te technically jump up, hit this. If you jump, if you jump right, if you do it the right way, you'll land on the thwomp just like what he originally intended to be able to complete the level. So there, I guess you can technically say that there's multiple paths, but... In truth, it's kind of cheese, <laughs> but that's okay. But yeah, you do that, you take that spring, you get into there, you don't miss the jump, right? And then you do a spring drop to finish the level. But yeah, this took me an hour and a half to complete, and now the fact that I have to redo it is really making me angry, so... I'm hoping that it'll take like 20 minutes, but truth be told, like, that's not gonna happen. This level was really difficult, 
I'm actually super happy that I completed it. But hopefully we'll beat it here soon. Grab that in there. Oh, there we go. Perfect. We'll do it twice. Why not? course clear. Awesome. Short and sweet and to the point. Ugh. I guess that means I don't have to edit. Well, I'll have to put the two things together, but I don't really need to edit anything. Wow, that only took me five minutes a second time. <laughs> it took me an hour and a half to beat this originally. Holy crap. <laughs> well, once you get the level, it's like not that bad. Anyway, I left a comment. I'll be leaving this comment every single time I beat a level. As... What the crap? Yeah, it's the little beat, beat a thing. And you're, you're required to have to uh, clear, clear the course, right? That's the, that's the goal. Anyway, I do want to talk about the list in the description for a little bit. If you don't care, don't care. But... Basically, it's a list of difficult levels that I'm aiming to beat. It started off with Hot Sponge, and it will end with the level Pit of Papanga Super Skyzo. Which is something that I'm absolutely going to regret later. <laughs> um, but it's got a list of speedruns, it's got platformers, it's got puzzles, it got, it's got everything. Something that can continuously challenge me to be able to complete harder levels, right? And it's got a list of like famous creators, some of my friends are going to be in this, the whole nine yards. I'm I'm super stoked. Uh, it's an amazing list. It's going to be challenging and it's gonna be difficult because it's got a lot of it's got a lot of hard levels in there. Um kinda just like this one. But how it works is every level that's red is me means that I haven't completed it. But when it turns green, it turns green not when I upload the video, but when I complete the level. So the so next one, for example, is Desertic Path by Laser Sword 33 or LS33 in this game. I will once I complete that level, that will turn green. Not when I upload the video, but when I complete the level. So I'm really excited. I hope you guys are too. This will be just a continuous list of difficult levels. I'm sorry this could this should have been longer. I had a lot of really annoying fails, but like I said, the video got stopped and I'm really agitated about that. Anyway, this is an amazing level. Go and check it out. Maybe you can go and beat it, right? See my wonderful beat it comment, right? <laughs> anyway, thank you all so much for watching, and until next time, I will see you all later.